welcome to Chateau de Taifur. We're in the Pomerol Appalachian today, very famous Appalachian as you may know. And we've been lucky enough to hear the bells ring. <laughs> we've been lucky enough to be presented uh, to the Chateau by Claire Moex. Hi, I'm Claire Moex. I'm very pleased to present you today the family run estate, Chateau Taifur in Pomerol and Chateau Tosin and Hermitage, saint emilion Grand Cru. Uh, let's begin, let's start with uh, some history. Uh, at the beginning of the 20th century, the whole Moex family was living in Corrèze in the center of France. <laughs> it's my great great grandfather, Antoine Moex, who did his military service in Libourne and discovered the potential of the Bordeaux Right Bank vineyard. He then left his native Corrèze and decided uh, and, and start Bordeaux wine trading. Mm. He went by train with his bicycle to the north of France and in Belgium to sell Bordeaux wine door to door. Mm. His business worked so well that he decided to become a winemaker. And uh, he has the opportunity to acquire Chateau Taifer in 1923. It's his son, Jean-Marie, who acquired Chateau Tosin and Hermitage in 1953. In 2013, my husband, Cyril, and I took over the management of the family run estate. We are very proud to be the fifth generation to carry on the family tradition and to craft two great wines on two emblematic Bordeaux terroirs, mm. Pomerol and saint emilion and our philosophy is to reveal the personality of the properties by shaping the wine uh, closer to this beautiful terroir. So now we're going to taste the uh, 2015 Taifur and then we're going to see what our professional and property owner can describe in the wine. Yeah. Cool, and the, the um, blends of this wine. Oh, so the grape variety proportion is 85% Merlot, 15% Cabernet Franc. Mm. 2015 is a, is a great vintage in Bordeaux. The climate of the year was, was dry and hot and followed by a cool summer end. Mm. Um, the, the quality of the grape allowed us to vinify and age the wine with uh, all simplicity. Yes. Uh, uh, for me, so the nose is on red and black fruit mm. with notes of smoke, uh, spices, and cocoa bean. Mm. Cocoa bean, yeah. Yeah. Can smell it. Uh, the attack, I'm sorry, je ne peux pas boire. Oui, je comprends. The attack is ample and dense and gives way to a, mid a velvety mid palate with aromas of strawberry, uh, cherry, and rose and notes of uh, cloth, paper, tobacco, um, what else? <laughs> That's a lot, That's yeah. good. And the finish is long, um, with velvet, velvety and racy tannin. Oh. No. Racy tannin. Yeah. Racy. 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 Cool. No, you like it? Yeah, I like it. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, it works. Racy tannin. Tannins. Yeah. All the wine is aged in French oak barrels. Mm -hmm. We have 40% uh, of new oak and 60% of one year okay. old. Okay, yeah. Cool. Oak, yeah. Mm. Très bien. Cool. Bravo.